Hey guys, I have something a little special for you today. Uh, just uh, something I put together, a little house that I built. Um, I'm on a flat world here, so everything you see I did do myself. Uh, no world edit or anything like that, so let's begin. Uh, first and foremost, you know, traditional bushes, lights hidden underneath them. Brilliant, you know, basic stuff there. Utilize the, the carpet in here. Now one thing that I'm hoping uh, Jeb is working on fixing, uh, or, or, or rather I'm hoping it's something they're ever going to fix, I'm not sure if they're not, uh, or if he is, uh, but the ability to pull the down, because you can move it up, but you can't pull it back down without breaking it. Uh, of course we got the kitchen, real basic stuff here, nothing special. Uh, I didn't put a crafting bench in here because I didn't think it was necessary. This is, in fact, just a uh, this isn't a practical build. This is a build that I'm actually doing to apply to get onto uh, the World of Coralis' creative server. So, you know, again, real basic stuff. I know it's not the most amazing thing out there. I know it's not super fancy, uh, but I, I like it. Uh, I think it's one of the nicer things that I've I've done. Um, interior wise not so much but uh, outside definitely uh, it is actually inspired by a house and uh, any of you that do uh, any of you that do follow architecture uh, uh, or know architect names in their works uh, I'll give you a single chance to uh, or rather I'll give you a view that you might recognize it from. Now it's not 100% identical, obviously, but it is inspired. And this is that angle. This is the angle that's gonna give you the opportunity of figuring it out. Although let me switch to my other texture pack as it is going to be better. There we go, that's a little better. So this, this is, this is what uh, what it's supposed to be like. Now, there is a house in the world that's very famous. Uh, and if you can identify the house or uh, the house and the uh, architect, we'll do both, house, house name and architect, then you will get a chance to actually name this house. Uh, yeah, we'll do it that way. So just leave your answers in the comments below and uh, obviously like, subscribe, and favorite. Um, give you a quick fly around of this. This is build number one of what I'm doing. So, you know, there is another one as you can probably see that big white monstrosity over there. Uh, but yeah, I did the terraforming all by hand. Um, no world edits here. Uh, so I think I did a pretty good job, especially since I've never really terraformed before. But uh, yeah, so if you guys like it, uh, please say so in the uh, you know leave your comments in the comments below. Uh, I do read everything, so by all means, um, let me know what you think. I haven't gotten popular enough yet to where I can. Now, it does need a name, and like I said, whoever can figure out who the uh, the house and the architect of the house that inspired this, uh, then you'll get a chance. To, you'll actually be allowed to name the house. Um, you'll be entered in the chance to do so. So, we'll go from there. Now, this one, this is my other submission. It's still under progress, uh, you know, work in progress. I'm still constructing it. Also inspired by uh, another real house in the world, but I don't know who the architect is or the, um, or the name, what the name of the house is. So this one is just, uh, once it's done, I'll figure out another way to, you know, let you guys name it another contest of some sort uh, but yeah this this is my next one uh, actually this one was quite difficult to build so uh, the structure wise uh, because I had to get a circle going and then in the circle you know I had to make smaller circles and make sure that they did things properly plus I had to do another circle over the top and that circle had to curve <laughs> with this so uh, it was definitely a lot of work but tons of fun and I'm glad I did it uh, because it just looks, in my opinion, just looks really, really good um, overall. Not to mention the fact that it's tri-level. It's got three floors, so if you come in here, you got the first one. You know, 
come in through here. You know, something I did just like little rooms. I might actually make these the stairs or something, uh, the stairwells up or to the next floor. I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to do here yet. But you've got this one. It drops down a little bit. And then you've got the second level and the third level. So you can see it's a lot of work. Again, I'm doing this all by hand. Um, I'm not using any kind of uh, world editing or manipulation tools except for you know commands of course but uh, yeah so this I'm, I'm, I'm actually having a lot of fun building these so uh, if you have any comments leave them in the description below as well uh, find out how we can generate names for this one uh, thanks for watching and you have a great day